Well, thanks for tuning in. Uh, you're basically joining another session with Jack, the rally art guy, as most people know me as. Uh, it's another weekend where we're working on the car again. Uh, we had some minor damage and stuff done, doing some rally racing off-road, gravel racing, all sorts of fun in the last two weeks. We've had some snow now, so um, we're just trying to uh, start engineering a few parts for the car that aren't really made. Um, there is one place that makes a skid plate for the car. It's a 09 Rally Art, but they went over $300, and that's in the U.S. So right now we're kind of fabricating our own. Um, we are just uh, got the old parts off, which is basically all plastic pieces that are all put together with plastic clips and a couple bolts, which really doesn't offer much protection at all. Um, what I've done right now is uh, we had some cardboard, we tried it out, it wasn't working too good and you couldn't really see it was kind of hard to maneuver. I've just used uh, some drop cloth, some basically uh, six mil uh, vapor barrier, laid it out, uh, basically marked all our whole locations and where we need to put in a couple uh, plates for servicing for oil changes, that being the oil plug itself and the oil filter. Um, other ones aren't too uh, done on a regular basis like the transmission servicing and stuff like that so we can always pull the whole plate down at that time um, so that's our beginning template uh, we're gonna have to transfer that obviously to some um, aluminum sheeting at some point get that fabricated and then do a trial fit and go from there but this is step one basically um, I'm just gonna throw this down take a quick look underneath the car here Get down on the creeper and as you can probably see um, we don't really have much protection right now and things have gotten pretty muddy just with the plastic in there um, looking down the carriage you can see all the grass and mud still stuck to the undercarriage here but the idea is to have something that's going to follow the actual um, line of the the front end around and use the clips they're existing and try to maybe fabricate a couple additional mounting uh, locations just to kind of stiffen it up and provide additional protection maybe put a couple slots in it for venting because the tranny on this car tends to be very temperamental and overheat almost every time we take it out so we have to baby the transmission on this thing and this is one of the things we want to protect um, I guess that's it for this episode we'll update you as we uh, progress uh, once we get to the next stage once we get the initial piece in here to fit uh, drill the holes and uh, basically go from there um, once I do have it figured out if anybody's interested maybe we'll make a run of maybe about 20 or 30 of them and uh, offer f them for sale through PayPal or something like that but right now I've never attempted anything like this at least not in regards to uh, something to sell to other people but it's something that's not really available there is one company who makes a skid plate for this car but it's a piece of crap it's basically a square piece of uh, sheet metal and what as you can see looking by the parts the whole front end like we want to protect both of the corners as well we have our windshield washer fluid which is only plastic if we were to get a, a large chunk of uh, rock or something hit that we'd be leaking windshield washer fluid all over the place so we want to make sure the whole front end is buttoned up and protected but anyways we'll talk to you later on the next video all right bye bye